Alrighty, so here we go. Um, I have so many packages sitting in a pile since I got back that I don't know everything I have. So I'm pretty certain since this is green that this is the Toy Story Alien set. Um, I was going to do a different unboxing for you today. And I started it and then I realized I didn't have the batteries I needed for it. So... They will be here tomorrow, so that'll be tomorrow's video instead. Um, so today, we're going to open Mr. Kevin, as they call me on the cruise ship, um, my favorite set, which you're probably shocked that I haven't already opened this because I have so many Toy Story Alien figures. But I honestly almost forgot that I had this because I have so many things to open. Um, the funny thing is about bubble wrap a lot of times from Asia is they're cheap and they actually don't even have hardly any air in the bubbles. So let me get this off of here and we'll go ahead and open this. It's hard to keep a clean room when you've got uh, so much stuff. Unfortunately, the box is a little banged up which sadly happens often, and I know some people complain about it um, in my videos about uh, I wouldn't buy from there. But I'm not going to pay way more than I need to when I'm also guaranteed if there's something wrong, it's going to get replaced or my money back. So no loss to me. If I was not going to be able to get a replacement or my money back, then yes, I would have an issue. Otherwise, you do not, because a lot of the times... It doesn't matter um, whether the box is slightly damaged. I'm not keeping them in the box. So we're going to go ahead and open that. There are, as you can see, nine figures. There is a chaser. And if you saw my video yesterday, we had good luck and actually got the chaser. Oh, sorry, I ruined the video. But if you want to go take a look at it, I was very surprised. The odds were 1 in 72, and I believe, let me see on this box, I believe the odds are the same on this one. They usually are, um, blah, 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 uh, some of it is in English. Um, oh, geez, it's even higher. It is 1 in 108, so oof. And the secret one is, I will show you somewhere in the video, actually. But let's go ahead and open these. I will show you the entire box in a second. But uh, let's see. I'll show you the entire box. And this is official. Everything from part Pop Mart is official. This is the mystery one, which I already know it, what it is. I'll uh, put it up here to show you. And if we get it, obviously, you'll see that in the video. And I love that most companies now, at least Pop Mart, puts a little pull tab here. Because uh, sometimes I have trouble getting these open. So that's great to have a pull tab. And let's try not to see the card. These are smaller figures, unfortunately, which sucks when the prices are kind of still the same. But uh, let's see who we get first. It is the artist one first. <laughs> so uh, either he's baking a cake and got frosting on him, which he does not because there is an accessory um, in the box. And um, they always put these in there. They're uh, to keep your product fresh. Alrighty. Sorry, I had to stop the video for a moment. Um, all right. Well, of course, this one is the artist, which is ironic because obviously, you know, I'm an artist, so that's the first one we get. And here are its accessories. These are um, the paint roller. Um, 
What's funny enough, people always assume because I'm an artist, I like to uh, paint houses. Um, absolutely not. <laughs> I do not like painting houses. Um, that's my least favorite thing to do. So let me see how this one works. Actually, let me look at the picture. Um, okay, so is he standing on the paint? Yeah, kind of weird. Um, I'm not sure why you would stand in the paint that you're painting, but that's what he's doing. But that's pretty cute. Basically, you push this down until it sits on there. Whoops. And then uh, I'll show you a 360 as I always do at the end. But basically, he is standing in the paint that he's painting, and he has it all over him. That's usually how I ended up. Uh, um, or I take too long, and my wife yells at me because I take forever, because I'm too much perfectionist, and I use tiny brushes around the windows and stuff. But uh, I do not like painting houses. Um, I still haven't finished uh, one of the bathrooms that I started several years ago. Um, that's the fun things of having ADHD also. So I'm, uh, I start lots of projects and don't finish them. I don't mean to, I just get so much going on. Um, here is number two. And man, I am so tired today. Um, I don't know if it's my medication or I just have not caught up. Um, this one seems bulky. Let's see what this one is. Ooh, this one is a magician. Look at that. He's so cute. All right, there's his, he's sitting in the hat. Let me get his accessories. And, ooh, he's got cute little bunny ears, as you can see. There is the card. And then, uh, let's see. I guess a razor is probably easier to get this out. This one doesn't have easy pull tabs like normal. There's his magic wand. And then that, see the little magic wand? And then you put that in his hand. There we go. And then you put these cute little ears. Um... Ooh, they're magnetic. That's cute. They're magnetic. They just stick on his head. So he has a magnet in his head. And they just stick on there. It looks like they're supposed to be cardboard cut out. So that's cute. It's like he made his own little ears. But yeah, they just stick on there with a magnet. That's pretty cute. All right. Do you believe in magic? Do you remember that song? I know you do. You always got a friend with big red shoes. Do you know what that's from? Fast food place that's very bad for you to eat. McDonald's. That used to be a song by um, Ronald McDonald. And let's see. This one's a little chunky. Also. Ooh, this one's cute. I should have. Too bad I didn't open this ahead of time before I left. I could have taken this to the beach with me. That is super cute. Um, it's making a sand castle. Let me get his accessories. Um, there is the card for it. I have so many cards. So many, so many cards. There we go. That one's easy to open. I probably just missed the part on the other one. Um, okay. Instead of putting them in the castle, he actually is just putting them in his hands. And now I'm going to have to, I'm out of, I'll have to show you, I'm out of room to put Toy Story Alien figures. I've had to put some in storage because um, IKEA doesn't make um, the uh, glass display cases anymore and I'm all out of them and the ones I do find are very expensive. Um, they used to be as low as $60 and then COVID happened and they went all the way up to $120 and then they stopped making them and then I think they got a replacement that's way more expensive. So at some point um, when I have money I'm going to get some new display cases. <laughs> but uh, that one was cute. Let's get rid of these boxes. Um, 
I need a big um, garbage can just to sh throw all my junk in. I do recycle the um, the boxes um, because I'm a responsible adult in some manner. Um, but uh, gosh, I got so much stuff for you guys to and girls to open. Um, our next one is. He's got his little eyes peeking through the bag. I have been chosen. He's winking at us. Thank God they put these holes in here. The little dude wouldn't be able to breathe. There we, have, there we go. He's squinting. Squinting Tarantino. Ah, that was a horrible pun. All right, let's see which one this is. This one is... Ooh, I like this one. He's making cake. I don't really like cake. I like ice cream cake. But I don't like regular cake, although on occasion I do. If it's really like a moist cake and not dry. Um, so uh, this is super cute. It's making me hungry a little bit. Look at that. I guess it's an apple pie, sort of. It's interesting. And um, then the fork. Oh, I see. The fork goes in as... Um, his hand here there is a little peg so that goes in his hand maybe if I can get this in here there we go I'm not sure why he's only looking for one with one eye he's trying to aim for the uh, apple but there you go cute so uh, yeah don't forget to watch uh, at the end of almost all my videos if it's something with a lot of figures or whatever, I always do a 360 at the end so you get yourself a good look at the figure. Um, I know some people do their videos all, all the ways from seeing the person in the videos, but then you don't get to see the figures up close, and I, I like that. I like to be able to share with you the details, and you know you can decide if you want something or not and get to see all the cool stuff in it. This is a big one. Here we go. There's a chunky boy. And it is. Woo, look at that one. My man's got some long hair. Or girl. Um, you never see female aliens. I wonder why that is. That's kind of like the Smurfs. There's one Smurfette. And then all the rest of them are males. Kind of makes you wonder, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> Poor Smurfette. Um, but yeah, I think that's supposed to be hair, sort of. And then, look at that, he has a giant light bulb. Let's see what the picture is on the card. So he is a um, fortune teller. Eventually they're going to run out of themes for these aliens. They keep coming up with new things all the time. But there you go. He is a fortune teller using a light bulb, which is very cute. And then, like I said, I'll show you at the end up close. That way you can see. It's hard to see that far away. But um, I will show you at the end a close-up so you can enjoy the cuteness up close. And uh, I know you're probably surprised you haven't seen this sooner from me. Um... I do my best to get them out quickly, but I was away for like two weeks, so these finally arrived, and I saw, and I like, told my son, get them off the porch, they're here. Um, I don't know what this one is yet, I'm not looking. Put that card right there, and then we will see what we get in this one. We get... Um... I don't know what it is. It's um, supposed to be the actor. Of course it is. The actor. With its... Uh... Oh, have you seen the trailer for... Um... It makes me think of a play. Um, Stranger Things is going to be a Broadway play next year. And it looks really good. It's based on... Before, like the Harry Potter play. It's before... Um, the TV series and it looks really good so I might eventually go to that unfortunately if I do I can't really share it with you 
Look at that, another magnetic one. I just love how ingenious these people are. Uh, somewhere hidden in here, it just snaps on like that. And it doesn't come off. So cool. I like that. That is neat. And then you have this beautiful mirror to enjoy yourself. You look at you can see what my phone case is. Bet you didn't expect that. <laughs> there you go. It's got Toy Story aliens all over it. I bet you thought maybe it was going to be Barbie or something. <laughs> but nope. My camera is a... Uh, yes, I use my phone all the time to do my videos. It's 4K and uh, does better than most YouTubers I see's video cameras who pay thousands of dollars for them. And uh, yeah, so there he looks is looking at himself, probably reenacting um, his lines or her. I don't know exactly what it is. Um, like I said, you never see female ones. Ugh. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it's a... Oh, it's the plant one. So we already know, unfortunately, because I, I know what the base is. There is the card. And then we got two left. Um, two left. Perhaps we got the chaser, perhaps not. And I really don't care so much. And the funny thing is, um, this particular one, um, the Lucky Charm one, was actually a chaser in another series. Um, but this one you actually get. It's not the chaser. But uh, I guess it's uh, the plant. <laughs> I, don't you dress up as plant? I always do. Uh, speaking of plants, we planted a garden this year, and it did horrible. I don't know if because it was so hot, but we planted tomatoes, and none of them ripened, um, only a few. And we planted strawberries, and they didn't do well. And the only thing that grew was the potatoes. So uh, I guess all we can plant is potatoes. So we tore the whole garden down, and we're not doing any more garden. Um, at least not any plans to. Um, but yeah, there you go the plant and that's when I think of uh, I guess these are like careers or it just says alien immersive experience but let's see what the next one is I guess hortic horticulture is the word if you're someone who does uh, wants a job in plants alrighty oh another big one let's see what do we get Ooh, I like this one. This reminds me of the big piece one. I love that. I'm so glad we got this one. Look at that. Cheese pizza. And if you don't already recall, I will show you. Actually, I'll walk over and get it for you if you've never seen the big version of this. Um, this one is super cute. I really like this one. <laughs> uh, that's what I want to dress up as pizza. <laughs> A big slice of pizza greasy pizza that one is cute let's see does it come with anything else probably not just has the tag but i'm gonna walk over and show you if you haven't already seen on my channel i have tons of different toy story alien figures and if i can get in this cabinet um hold on there is a giant piece of pizza with two aliens in it. Look at that bad boy. You can order this also on AliExpress. I think it's between $20 and $30. Um, and this is the first one I got. I think I only have one of these. However, excuse me, I have two burger ones and then they have a mini burger. The only one I don't have is a clear um, version of the burger. That one was more pricey. It's like over $100, and I just didn't feel like spending that. But this is super cute. So this definitely reminds me just a very small version of this. And that is super cute. And that one just says um, the pizza cosplayer, which I have seen Halloween costumes Um dress like that but we're gonna put that slice right there now it's making me hungry all right last one 
Let's wish good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck. Boop, boop. And do we get the chaser? And the only one left is um, the billionaire. I'll go for that. I'll be, I'd like to, I'll like to be a thousandaire. <laughs> or, um, you know, 100,000, millionaire, millionaire. You really can't, it's crazy enough, you really can't buy a ton of stuff with a million dollars. I mean, you can if you're, I mean, like a house or something. I would like a nice new house with a st room just for all my Disney stuff. Alrighty. Did we get the billionaire or did we get the chaser? Let's see. It's the billionaire. So, <laughs> my wife's funny. She just put, slid something under the door. Um, we got the billionaire. So that one is cute. I don't know if there's any uh, anything else. Oh yeah, there is. Let me see, this is the billionaire. So I guess we're not, we didn't get the chaser, which I really don't care because the chaser is kind of lame actually. I uh, will show it to you. But, um, oh, this is soft and squishy. I think it's a briefcase. I think it's supposed to be a briefcase. What is it actually? Let's see. What in the world is that? Oh, it's his glasses. That's the strangest way to put them in there. But I guess so they don't get broken because they could shake around. But look at that. He has little glasses that he can't see through. So those are practical. Um, and then he has a coin that I guess he puts in his hand. So I would like to be the billionaire or millionaire or thousandaire. Any money whatsoever would be nice. And there you go. Put that in there. Oof. There's a little pinhole and a thing that you stick in there. And then there you go. He's holding a Toy Story Alien Planet Pizza Planet coin. Very cute. And then you put his glasses on. His life is, his future is so bright, he's got to wear shades. That's from a song from the 80s, kids. <laughs> um, look how cute that is. So I guess that, yeah, his his... Gold bling is so shiny, he's got to wear sunglasses. So yeah, that wraps that up. Um, you know the drill. If you haven't already, please subscribe and thumbs up the video. My man just lost his glasses. And uh, share with a friend. I would greatly appreciate it. I'd like to have more people in the family. And I do call you the family because I think you are to me. And uh, i like to share my life with you, and I hope you enjoy it. We got way more stuff to uh, do in life, so uh, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss anything. Got lots of more giveaways. God, I got so many cards to give away. Um, sketch cards that I didn't give away on my trip because I'm a doofus. But, um, yeah, it's super cute. I love these all. I'd have to say my favorite. Whoops, lost his glasses again. Um... I'd have to say, I'm surprised like the billionaire wasn't like the chaser, but uh, I think I like the pizza one just because I really enjoyed um, this giant one. And uh, the artist one is kind of lackluster, to be honest. I mean, he's just, it's not really an artist. I mean, he's using a paint roller, I guess maybe some artists do, um, but that's more like painting a house to me. And uh, I don't like doing that, but yeah, I'd say the pizza one's my favorite. Let me know which one's your favorite. Um, and, uh, make sure you subscribe and stay tuned for the 360 and, uh, then stay tuned for the next video and giveaways that we will be doing shortly. So I'd like to wish you all a magical day and, uh, that's it for this video and I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.